Yeah, isn't that a completely different sample than the one that was shown in the cutscene that was in the previous zone? I'm surprised we came here first. This like this guy's like my head is a foot. You can now use the SOS flare. You have to take down I mean, if you're just gonna randomly shout it at me, I'll do it. Don't worry. I'll keep the scholars out of harm's way. But doing, yeah, ow, dick. Rude. It's a bad time to make the camera pan away. <laughs> Give me that red. Get that head. There we go. Hello. Wait, I'm on you. Probably not gonna be psyched about that. There we go. Hey. It's amazing how much cutscenes look like... Like... In-engine cutscenes look pre-rendered now. That's how far graphics have gotten. Also, my character does not look like he was made in a character creator. He looks like a pre-made character. It's, it's, that's blowing my mind, too. How seamlessly he fits into those cutscenes. Which part of you am I allowed to hit? I guess if I do heavies, it'll work, maybe? Screwing up that underbelly. Oh, he's back up. Whoo! Boy, that was close. I will now be completely safe as I do this. Do I get to kill you? Or are you also gonna run away? Ow! Oh! These buffs don't last, do they? the giant poop piles he's putting everywhere. Ow. Rude. Fake out. Haha. <laughs> I know your game. Your head is a foot. I hope you understand that about yourself. He's he's pushing like a little tank around. What is that? Oh, it's a it's like a ranged weapon. That's awesome. Oh god. That's not awesome. That hurt. Drink that potion. Drink it better. Drink it better. Drink it. Did you even drink the potion? You didn't even use it. Were you stunned, I guess? All right, there we go. That was the wrong button. Ow. Oh, he's r is he running away? Oh, he's piecing out. You come back here. 
Oh, Hunt of Baroth is the objective, so I am supposed to kill this one. Okay. Dude, I think I can see where you are. Spoilers. Okay, no, no, I don't know if I can clear that. Oh, maybe, maybe there was a hooking spot. Mining outcrop? <gasps> it's back! Or this is a different spot, but it looks like the same spot. And a god bug. I have a breather, I should use it. Oh yeah, I have all these things stocked up, I might as well use them. Purple medicine, nutrients. Slightly increases your maximum health level, that's cool. Mega nutrients, even more better -er version of that, basically. Herbal medicine is just awesome at being an antidote, basically. Yeah, oh, I can cancel the SOS flare. No, I got it. That was intentional. Our weapon's not green. There we go. Are there any thing? I'm not seeing any things for actually tracking this guy. I'm like, I, I, there's him. But I don't see the actual other components. Probably want to go in the goopy goop if I can avoid it. Get in, get in his head. Ah, he's moving around a lot. Oh boy. There we go, get in his head. I messed that up, didn't I? There we go. Get up in here. I uh, let that stamina drain a bit. He's piecing out. Mounted. Oh. I don't think he likes this very much. <laughs> God damn it. Ah. I broke something. Cool. Maybe he'd be more vulnerable? Oh, I see. In a bad spot there. It's got to be more vulnerable now. There we go. I'm not sure what the what the whetstone meter means yet. I understand lower is lower, obviously. Where's the parts that broke off? Can I loot them, or is it not one of those types? What I find odd is that I've seen it be full but yellow, and I've seen it be nearly empty but green. I think it might go through tiers, like if you get a bunch of... I think that if you... it might be a thing where if it, it stays green till it empties once, then it might become yellow and then empty again and become uh, orange and then red. Whereas I thought that it, the part of the meter it was currently on would affect where you were on that. Mainly because that's how the meter is represented on the other screen. Minerals! I want to do some mining, even though I don't really know if I would need any. And I should really be chasing him. But new location to check out and all that. Wait, am I back at the HQ? Is that what happened just now? It might be what just happened.
Oh, bones. Monster bonus. Oh. These are the wrong kinds of bones. Anyway, let's click on Mr. Barrowth. I wonder what condition Rathian's in. Like if I could just take him out. What was this icon for? The first Wyvarian? Hunter? This is not the right time. You will know when the time is right. You can have this. Heart shell powder. Neat. Just getting gifts from people. Oh, inventory's full. Gonna have to take care of that. Let's go beat this dude up. Uh... Oh, I think that was a canned animation. Okay. I wasn't sure if he'd be able to simply... I was, I was a little afraid to figure out how swim, swimming works as a mechanic. Like, am I, about, am I about to drown? <laughs> Rapidly oscillating depths of water here. I hope you took good advantage of your chance to rest. Boink. Get that head. Oh, that doesn't look like red. It's not red. It's you. Come on. Yeah. That's orange again. Hind leg. That's green. Got him. Take any bad hits. Ouch! Owie, owie, owie. That's not good. Roll. Ow. Was not prepared for rolling. Pop it down. Chug, 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 chug. Uh oh. Up in the air. Yeah. Oh, my stuff's gone. What is he doing right now? He looks like he's having a terrible time. What is up with him? Was he having a seizure? Hey, come back here. Woo! That was close. Okay, that was closer and that it hit me. Mainly. Oh, I just canceled out. I just canceled out of that drinking animation, didn't I? Like to figure out the an animation timings a little bit more. Ow! <laughs> Landed on his attack. No. Stamina meter needs to get back up there. Let's eat. There we go. That helps me out. Ow. <laughs> he roared. Are you running away again? Very naughty of you. What does that meter mean? 
I have like almost like a speedometer in the top corner that I'm looking at. Iron helmet crab? What the hell? Oh. Piercing pod. That's good for your armor, right? I mean, well, bad for your armor. I mean, good, but good for me against your armor, right? No. Ah. I'm in the poopy. Help. I got in the poopy. Uh oh. Huh. Get in there. That's all three. Good. Mounted. I aimed that one correctly. About to charge. Oh yeah, he is. Oh, that was bad. Aha! Got rid of me that easily. That attack on Titan move is fantastic. Ah! Nope. Slide to the left. Slide to the right. Crisscross. Oh. Oh, slash furry. I didn't say flurry or fury. Instead, instead I just said furry. <laughs> What am I allowed to hit? I don't think I'm doing damage to him correctly. So I'm like hitting the wrong spot or something. But it's really hard to aim your attacks. Oh, somebody's weakened. That wildlife might be getting, aiming to attack me. I'm gonna get out of this water real quick. Come back here, buddy. I just wanna talk. Just a moment. I kind of want to take uh, all of these items off my quick bar. I need to figure out how some of this UI works. Because this, like, barbecue spit and fishing rod and stuff is, like, not on my high list. I want, like, a healing dedicated bar, basically. Oh, he's resting. Alright. You think you can hide? You can't escape my fury. Uh -oh. oh no. Get out of the stuff. Ooh, that kind of worked out. If for but a moment. Land on him. Nope. Missed that chance. Missed that chance. Something fierce. Now, there's so many things on my quick bar. Uh, but the radio menu sucks. <laughs> okay, he's kind of on my pet right now. Oh, that's not gonna last. That's not gonna last. Oh, it lasted. Surprisingly, it lasted. <laughs> Kaiklu is paralyzed, I think. Nope. There's the attack up.
When are you gonna run out and fall apart? I like how he makes a steam engine sound when he charges. It's completely absurd. I bounce off of him a lot. I'm not really sure what's safe to attack. He looks pretty armored. Surely eventually the tail will come off because it seems pretty vulnerable. Am I stuck in something? Uh oh. Ooh, what's that? A piece fall off? That's a thorn pot, a powerful type of slinger ammo. Attacking the part it's latched onto deals blunt damage. Meow. I need to recover my health. What are you highlighting over here? His goopiness? How are we fighting that under the surface? Alright, an old mud crack. Uh, mud cracks don't really persist underwater, I don't think. Oh my god, I'm running out of time. Go, 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 go. I don't think a mud crack would persist underwater. The whole point of a mud crack is that it's mud. It's mud that dried out. We're not, wasn't I beating you earlier? If you run out of stamina, you'll be winded and vulnerable. Uh oh, does he see me? Oh, he sees me. There's so much stuff in here. Oh boy. Ow. Ow. Get the head. Come on. That's not the head. Oh well. Ow. Ah. Ow. Come back here. Oh man, I'm stunned. That's... They keep... Every time, whenever it puts my weapon away, I get... I lose, I lose track a little bit. Ah, shit. Jesus. No. Uh -oh. Nope, he's not attacking me yet. There we go. Get out, get out. There we go. Get his head, damn it. There we go. Hi, I'm on your head again. You like that, right? Now, my meter. Yeah, I... that didn't recover. Okay, he looks like he's about to attack. Uh, he's like winding up. Oh, hey. Yeah, I have no sense of how far I am in the fight sometimes. Because sometimes I'm like, this is never going to end, huh? <laughs> I'm just, I'm going to lose now. Mind that crap. Get those innards out. Don't mind the weird turtle monster. I saw him limp, but I feel like I saw him limping like two times ago when he was running away, and then he start, then he seemed to be really prepared again. I, I was worried he had healed or something. There's no reason to be doing this, but I'm doing it anyway. 
I should really be grabbing everything around me. You, you get to come with us, lucky herb. Sleep herb. It's like an e herb, except you go to sleep, making you completely defenseless against all the monsters. Hooray. Quest complete. you're back. Oh, don't worry. I found a safe place for the scholars to hide. I guess I'll go round them up. <laughs> Wait for us back at camp. You there. Are you part of the Fifth Fleet? Then that means the Elder Crossing is upon us again. The years fly by faster than I can count them. I too am a hunter of the First Fleet. Might I trouble you to share your tale with me? Let's find a suitable place. So, my old friends are well. Praise be. It sounds like the good scholars are as incorrigible as ever. Might I ask, are you tracking the monster that dropped that massive slag? <sighs> I as well. It seems so easy. Follow the trail, find the truth. Well, it has been a pleasure. Nearby you will find my camp. I trust it will be of some avail to you and the others. Please pass a message on to the commander that I am safe. But a force compels me on and I intend to see where it takes me. If you too feel so compelled, then we will cross paths again at the end of all of this. It was? It's okay, you're allowed to speak, it's fine. It's like, may I trouble you f uh, for your tail? It's like, oh, that'll be a big trouble because my character doesn't speak. Yeah, it's a big problem. Oh boy. No, I lost money because I got decked by that monster. At least I didn't... Oh, hey, level one Zora Magdoros. I guess that was the point of the mission, yeah. At least I didn't use my uh, ticket, I suppose, my voucher, because I didn't... Uh, I would have gotten a reduced reward. I don't want to waste that. Added jewel cactus to the ingredient list for delivering jewel cactuses. So we got a whole new map. Didn't even feel done with the previous one yet, although I'm not sure if the... I, I'm, I assume the quests aren't done with that zone either yet. They're just introducing some other options so that the game doesn't have me, like, marathoning that one jungle for the entire playthrough. Which makes sense. Fine work out there. Thanks to you, our people are safe and we know more about the tar our target than ever. Since you left, we've been uh, charting all the evidence we've collected across the continent. The scholars think they'll be able to pinpoint Zora Mag Magderos's location soon. Until then, okay. seems like a scholar has gotten separated from his escort. I need the fifth to go find him and guarantee his safety. The scholar was separated from his escort while collecting evidence in the Wild Spire Waste. The wow, Wild Spire waste immediately. that was fast. We immediately have a, a new camp. 
Mm -hmm. We had to work for the other one. The man you saw used to be with the first first fleet. He was the commission's only why Varian hunter. Truth is, he's essential to our mission here. But some time ago, we lost track of the fellow. One moment he said he'd discovered the secret of this continent. Next, he's gone. Mm -hmm. I tried to go with them, but he wouldn't have it. You're the first to have seen him since. Part of me is furious with him for leaving, but honestly, now I'm just glad to hear he's okay. If he said not to worry, then I won't worry. He'll return to us when he's good and ready. Thank you. Thanks for hearing. Thanks for the heartening news. I mean it. No, we lost Sylvia and Hamaru Shimada. Whoever these people are, nobody helped me. I asked for help and none of, none of you helped me. You can all burn. Hello. The commission's purview isn't limited to just monsters. It's our job to research plants, endemic life, geology, weather, and the list goes on and on. Sometimes hunters go out to conduct their own studies, and sometimes we issue specific requests. Okay, tell me what you found. That stuff. Ooh, armor sphere. And armor sphere. Two armor spheres. Oh yeah, we finished the hunt two monsters thing. Complete deliveries. Turning in delivery request. You can complete delivery requests you accept from researchers by turning it in as specified items at the research center. Completing delivery requests will reward you with new ingredients for the canteen or upgrade your facilities. One mega potion. Okay. So this is where you turn it in. Diced steak. Moss swine hide. Monster bone L. Damn. Okay. Yeah, I don't have that. Registered bounties. Small monster culling. Two armor spheres. Wild, spi wild spire waste. Three quests. Sure. Do these stack? I wouldn't I be accomplishing both at the same time? That seems really abusable. Mining outcrops, bone piles, flora. The bone pile seems like it's a higher cost. Seems like I'd want to do whatever's easiest, right? Oh wait, this, these are blatantly... I guess you get more research points. You don't actually get more armor spheres. Hmm. Well, flora's the easiest, so of course I'd do that one. Just because that means I get the reward faster. Do I talk to you guys individually, or... I think they're one group. Yes. Don't you fret. We've been examining the that evidence you've found top to bottom. If anyone's going to nail down where Zora Magdoros is headed, it's me and my team. And you can put up- and you can put that in writing, heh. <laughs> so what is it? So two updates now. Zora Magdaros and Baroth. Oh, I've got, already got the guidance to next track thing set up. Curious to hear about this guy. Baroth seeks out ants, their favorite snack, and mark their territory with mud. They attack potential rivals with their devastating charging attack. They hunt ants? How can they even reasonably see and target the ants? That just seems weird. While using- while it uses hardened mud as armor, Baroth can also fling it off its body as an attack. Use water element weapons or your slinger to gradually knock off its mud. So you're supposed to go after it with... water? Wild Spar Waste. Its weak points are its tail and its front paws. You can sever the tail, you can break all of its legs and its head. Hmm. So, it has different states for when it is or isn't covered in mud. When it's covered in mud, it's vulnerable to water, but immune to fire, or really resistant to it. And when it's not covered in mud, it's really vulnerable to fire, but, ha but water no longer has an effect on it. Thunder has no effect, ice and dragon are... eh. Okay. Huh. That's interesting. 
I'd need to be able to better spot when it's changing its states. But at least now I guess I know what to look for. The fifth fleet are only are the only ones I can trust with this. Good to see you. Splendid. The fifth fleet. Just who I was looking for. At present, we at the Research Commission Survey and Capture Squad, or the Go-Getters for short, are studying the Kula Yaku's behavior. We are hoping we can capture one alive, accustom the scout flies to its unique characteristics, and then release it. That will allow us to track the monster and uncover its mode of life. And there's nothing in the world I desire more than that right now. Hence my decision to, re to request help from the Fifth. I would like you to perform the capture for us. Good luck. The quest is called Snatch the Snatcher. Any assistance you could give would be most appreciated. Snatch the Snatcher. Capture Aquila Yaku. I'm interested in that because I haven't actually done a capture yet. I don't know what you need to do to capture one. It might be Pokemon rules where you just beat it until it's limping around and then you hit it with a, a net. Once it's supposedly weak. I should visit my crafting list real quick. See what I can make. That's all craftable right now? Wow. I guess it's because I have access to all my stuff again. Oops. Blast coating. Still an arrow thing though. Bit curious about poison smoke bombs. Not sure if I've really encountered traps necessarily though, so far. That's the paralysis one, a net. Perfect for pitfall traps. That's a whole concept that hasn't really been introduced yet, so I'm not really sure what to do with that. All I know is that this is very limited inventory, so I gotta dump some of this stuff. So it's not the same thing as the net you actually use for capturing people. The pitfall... That's a, it's a, tr a net that's specifically for pitfalls, apparently. Ah? Oh, he's an eager fourth. I'm like, who's up, who's up on my stuff? What's that? The commander looks concerned. I wonder what's on his mind. Hopefully nothing bad. He's just like right up in my business. I'm like, who is this guy? Get him away from me. Go away. Laid back botanist. There's so many NPCs around. It's interesting that so many of them always have some sort of ongoing conversation. I think you can talk to like all of them. Not that it's all really necessarily impactful dialogue. I should have wishlisted my upgrades and I didn't. There we go. Just want everything from the future to be wishlisted so I can have some idea of when it's done. Anjanath scale. Oh. Well, I know where to get one of those, I guess. I think that suggests that those other pieces might also be Anjanath items. I think the middle of the screen might represent future progress. I, I talked about the idea of like maybe some of it you know, is unlocked by you progressing the story or something like that. I think that might be the yellow part of the screen that says under development in the middle. I think that might... We might be able to go further right once we get there. Otherwise, there's just not a lot of ranks. I now have one boulder bone and one monster bone M. So we're making tiny bits of progress, but I haven't even noticed when I got those to be honest. Oh well, it's marked now. 
I'll know. So you're the rank three, 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 yeah, two. I got a few of these now. There we go. Now how fast should I go up? We get half a level now. But that's true for both of the next levels, so there's no reason to spread it out necessarily. Pumping up that defense so that I can then lose all my armor rankings and then replace it with... Then upgrade to a new armor type and then be like, oh well, time to... Get, go back on all that armor ranking I did. No, not weapons. Actually, yeah, weapons. Uh, do I have access to a new... Glaive type yet? It's just these. Oh, this 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 got longer. You can make an alloy set. This look makes you look like a proper knight. I like I like the look of the Kulu set. But I'm not crazy about the stats. Okay. Makes you look like a pilot, basically. I like the Puke set, visually. Not in a big hurry, stats-wise, necessarily. The Baroth Helm, look at that. Let's just preview it all like this, actually. There we go. What the hell? Oh my god, what a cartoon character. Look at this. That is, like, dangerously close to being, like, a, some sort of columnar jointing set, too. It's more like a tractor, like, shovel set. It's honestly a Super Sentai monster of some kind. There's Puke. I like that set a lot. Alloy. Yeah, it's exactly what you thought it would look like. Kulu. I like that one a lot, too. <laughs> Baroth is hilarious. Oh my god. Just fight a few... Fight a couple Baroths and I'll be able to dress up like that for some reason. In which case, uh, I don't know. It's got high defense, admittedly. It's weak to fire, water, and and uh, ice, but boy, if it doesn't have a really high starting defense. What? That's the wrong, not the way to look at it. Skill info. In certain, yeah, it's called stamina thief. In in, in certain in attacks, I'm sorry. Increase certain attacks' ability to exhaust monsters. Oh. 10, 20, and 30% bonus exhaustion on the enemy. I kind of thought you'd gain their stamina. I'm like, how does that work? I don't know, but it sounds amazing. Reduces knockbacks and guard depletion. Slows down stamina depletion for attacks which continuously drain stamina, such as dashing. Reduces impairments to mobility while stuck in monster muck. It's very specific to that role, yeah. Reduces stun dur duration. Honestly, this seems like my kind of set. It's doofy looking as all hell, but it's... <laughs> the stats seem like they'd be helpful. The negatives are kind of a bummer. Like, the, ne the stats are straight up negative numbers, but, uh... Starting defense is super high. 14 per item, basically. Where am I at with these guys? Yeah, I put all these upgrades into these guys, but they're only at 10 and 14 themselves. I should probably just forge it. Ah! Oh cool, the one I can afford to forge is the chest piece. If it was the- it would have been, it would have been a bummer if it was the legs, because I just over-invested in those ones by comparison. I gotta see this. It does not look like it's meant to be worn by a person. <laughs> oh, my visual design. My poor visual design. I mean, I've gotta look at my palico now. If it can look like these things. A Baroth palico. Oh my god, he's precious. Look at him. He's a little- he's a little king. Look at that guy. Oh, you look absurd. How did- Anja. Oh, Anjanath. He looks like a little dinosaur. Oh my goodness. The thing is they let you do. See, so he's currently wearing Puke. <laughs> I can give him a little dinosaur helm on top of that if I want to. Rarity 3. Probably shouldn't spend my Anjanath scale on the... on him right now. He looks fine just the way he is. Can I nurture my Kinsect yet? Boulder Bones is gonna be a bit... I can't wishlist that. Makes it hard to keep track of. 
Oh my god, what happened to my character? <laughs> I'm so sorry. 